New at six with the shooting of a former Taft High School student by Austin police. Their focus demonstrators staged a peaceful rally on the deep west side this afternoon. The victim identified as Justin Howell was critically injured last month during a demonstration to protest police brutality. Paul Venema with more on today's rally and the Austin shooting. The demonstrators, nearly 200 strong, marched here to Taft High School, where 20-year-old Justin Howell had gone to school. He graduated in 2018 and was a student at Texas State University. We have voices, too, and we deserve to be heard. 16-year-old Devin Garza, who organized this rally, said the message they want heard is that they are against police brutality. Hands up! Don't shoot! That is the same message that Howell, who is described by friends as a black activist, carried when he joined a protest outside the Austin Police Department last month. He was hit by a beanbag fired by Austin police, witnesses said, as the officers responded to bottles and other items thrown at them by the demonstrators. Howell fell to the ground and struck his head. His family says he suffered serious brain injuries. It's wrong and there's no other explanation for it. It's just wrong. I can't breathe! For today's demonstrators, this was their chance to peacefully convey that message. These kids are out here in this, heart, in this hot sun, pouring out their heart and soul, trying to get people to hear them and hear their cries and hear their pain. Black Lives Matter! Many demonstrators were indeed youngsters. That was the reason Garza said she'd organized this rally for young people who she said feared the downtown demonstrations. This is what democracy looks like! But who wanted their voices heard. It's also not only for Justin Howell, but for everybody else, all the innocent black lives that were taken from police brutality. Black Lives Matter! Paul Venema, KSAT 12 News.